Public health experts say coronavirus is very different from the flu. The mortality rate appears to be much higher and there's a risk of overwhelming the health care system. 13 News Now reporter Evan Watson is in our studio to explain how canceling events is designed to save lives. This is what experts call flattening the curve. If we slow the spread of the coronavirus pandemic over time, we can treat patients within the capacity of our healthcare system. So mitigation is crucial. That's why so many big events are being canceled and why this is so different from something like the seasonal flu. Online classes, canceled events, self quarantines, they all have a purpose containing the spread of COVID-19. All of those activities have been aimed at slowing this down. If we can slow it down, then that will help ease the strain uh, that could occur otherwise on the healthcare system. Without protective measures, coronavirus cases could exceed the limits of the healthcare system. But with these protective measures, we can treat patients more easily. Hospitals won't be as overwhelmed and risks can be reduced. I'm hopeful that these, uh, you know, these rather extreme measures that we're taking are going to really pay off later. Brian Martin is the director of the Master of Public Health program at EVMS. He says COVID-19 is a virus like the flu, but it's a new virus and medical experts aren't sure how to predict its behavior. With uh, COVID-19, there's not only no treatment or no cure, but there's no inoculation. So anything that we can do to prevent the spread of it. On this graph, Martin says he hopes the preventative measures keep the spread of cases below the dotted line. What we want to see is that the uh, the low doesn't overwhelm the ability to treat the patients. He says he knows it feels like a lot, but for public health reasons, he puts it all in perspective. The alternative where we don't pay attention to this virus is that we could really see um, lots and lots of sick people in our community and that death rate could go up and we don't want that. This chart here is a projection based on CDC community mitigation data, but health leaders tell me they believe the canceling of events across the country will help health professionals treat this pandemic. In the studio, Evan Watson, 13 News Now.